Hello everybody, welcome back to the world of me. My name's Cougar. This is another episode from our camping and survival series. And this also kind of linked to our Amazon review series. What I got were these packages of MREs. I went ahead on Amazon, I was looking for, uh, for storage foods and things that I could uh, take with me that would be easy to use uh, for camping and uh, even for maybe not necessarily long-term survival, but kind of a short to midterm survival type thing and uh, I came across these uh, I got a 12-pack uh, box and uh, you, you when you get those when you check them out there's uh, basically there's two boxes a and B at least through who I got it from and uh, if you want to check them out they're down there in the description below I'll have a link but uh, a and B you have uh, a menu of 24 items and you've got menu 1 through 12 in the first box in A, and then you've got 13, 13 through 24 in uh, box B. This one here is menu number 12. Uh, it is elbow macaroni and tomato sauce. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead, we're going to open this up, and we're going to go ahead and prep and try all this out. It comes in kind of a bunch of plastic bags and whatnot, but you got this main bag and then you've got this kind of secondary bag that holds all of it but uh, all right so here we go first thing we've got is this is the elbow macaroni and tomato sauce and it is just in a simple flat bag type thing so there's that we have got right here this is a wheat snack bread so basically uh this is going to be some type of a, a wheat bread basically we've got um Let's see, chocolate, pro chocolate protein powder drink. So we've got uh, a chocolate, chocolate drink there. Um, it says that it's protein. We've got some hot sauce here. Uh, oh, look at that. That's pretty awesome. A bag of sour Skittles. And uh, you know, they do throw some name brand stuff in here. Uh, now we've got, uh, let's see, some cheese spread. And along with that, we've got uh, nut raisin mix, so kind of a granola type thing. And they come with these uh, nice plastic spoons, and these plastic spoons, they're, they're actually pretty durable, so you can actually reuse them if you want. Uh, let's see the piece of cardboard here. Now, this has uh, a couple things. First off, it has the nutritional information for the macaroni and, cheese, or macaroni and tomato sauce. Uh, and then on the other side here, it has some information. Uh, these are talking, it talks about how these are uh, core performance meals. But uh, if you notice, this is a sleeve. And the sleeve does fold in. Kind of, uh, kind of reminds me of like the sleeves for Hot Pockets. And uh, that's made like that because you're going to take your packet and put it in there. And when you do that, you're going to put it in there with this right here. This right here is your heater, and there is the instructions right here as to how to use it. Uh, this is sealed off, and basically just like the uh, hand warmers, when you open them up and uh, they start getting warm and you put them in your gloves or put them in your socks or something like that, or even just in your pockets, this is the same kind of thing, only this actually requires you to add water. Um, just very small amount like like a half an ounce or something like that. It's really really small amount and uh, It gets much hotter than those ones that uh, you use uh, that are air activated uh, But then you of course take and slip it in there with the food It then basically heats the food up for you because all of this is pre-cooked So if you needed to you could just tear into it and start eating without having to uh, uh, use the heater and uh, you know that that works that way as well now we've got a bag here and this is called a hot beverage bag and it shows you the uh, levels right there when you go to fill it up it has uh, 6 8 and 12 ounces and then it has some basic directions and that is used for what's inside here now what's inside here is your basically your supplemental stuff the stuff that's kind of the side things that people don't necessarily think about when they're going camping or, uh, or anything like that. When you have food, generally you want to season it or do something like that. And so that's actually kind of where this comes into play. Um, this has a few things with that as well as some other things. Um, here we've got a couple of chiclets or uh, 
pieces of the uh, little square gum. Um, I always considered them chiclets because that's what chiclets look like. Uh, we've got a little, uh, basically this is, a, it's a little towelette type thing, but it's uh, almost like napkin. It will cross between like napkin and a uh, tissue. So uh, you've got something to kind of clean up with a little bit. You've got a moist towelette, which is of course even better than that one. A pack of, of iodized salt, a pack of sugar, and then let's see, we've also got uh, creamer, which goes along with our instant coffee. And that's where the, of course, uh, bag of hot for hot beverages comes into play. And then along with that, it does actually come with a book of matches. Let's go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and get this started. We're going to go ahead and fast forward through some of this. You're not going to have to sit here and wait for me to prep all this. All right, so uh, here's uh, just a little handful here of the... Uh, nut and raisin mix and obviously lots of uh, nuts looks like uh, some peanuts as well as some other kinds of nuts that I'm not sure about and then we've got uh, the raisins here as well all right so uh, we let this go ahead and heat up and everything and uh, I mean it's just mildly warm it's not hot uh, like I said you're just using one of those little like hand type heaters to heat this up so it's not going to get you know anything like putting in a microwave or or on the stove or anything like that pull out our spoon here i can already smell it and it smells pretty nice um i've got the kind of traditional uh like i i think it's like is it basil oregano i think is what it is kind of an oregano smell to it um it basically just like uh, any kind of uh, kind of italian or spaghetti type of you know uh, foods so uh, but there we go, there's some of uh, the, uh, the noodles and everything. Uh, if it was heated up more, I'm sure it would uh, get a little creamier instead of being kind of still a little bit chunky. But uh, you know, that's kind of what it looks like coming out of the bag. And it's, it's good. I think it's better than like the Chef Boyardee's or, or something like that. I think it tastes a little bit better than that. Um, it has a little more spice to it. it, has a little more flavor to it, it's not quite so bland. Uh, definitely not bad and uh, it would be great for a meal if you're out camping or something like that. Now I did mix up the, uh, the protein drink here, so let's see how this tastes. It's very thick, um, very much almost like if this was like cold cold, this would be like a milkshake. It's kind of a mix between a milk chocolate and a dark chocolate flavor. It has, has some notes of dark chocolate in it. Um, kind of that, um, I don't know if you want to call it bitterness that dark chocolate has, but it has that kind of, uh, kind of smooth, creamy texture that milk chocolate has. So it's actually pretty, pretty good. I was really surprised. I didn't expect it to be all that great being a water mix. Let's go ahead and tear into the bread here. Obviously, they give you the do not eat silica packet. Try and keep the bread fresh. Um, obviously, this isn't like a regular piece of bread. It's more like what you would think of just like a piece of dough. Uh, it is cooked though. Um, now, I'm definitely gonna be using some of this uh, this cheese spread on it. All right, so and we'll go ahead and, ooh, this is uh, oily cheese. Okay, you can do that. I'm sure that's probably, well actually I could probably put the rest inside. I'm going to put the rest inside my uh, mac macaroni stuff. Alright, so put a little bit of the cheese on the bread here and have some cheesy bread. Um, let's see how this how this tastes. Mmm, that's actually really nice. I'm surprised. And uh, you can see there are some air pockets and stuff in there. It does look like regular bread. It's just a little more dense, but uh, it's, it's very nice. I mean, the bread tastes fresh, and uh, you know the cheese on it gives it a nice flavor and everything. Obviously, if you wanted to, you could put the macaroni on here and stuff too. I'm not even gonna worry about the Skittles because 
if you haven't if you haven't tried Skittles, go ahead and try them. But it's candy, just like any candy that would be at the grocery store or whatever. So uh, I don't think there's anything special about having those. Um, this is a standard package of Skittles. There's nothing special about it. Yeah, not hard to prepare. Uh, it comes in a pretty reasonable package with convenient size and everything. It's It's got a good amount of nutrition in it and everything. And, you know, it's something that can keep you going. Obviously, I didn't get into the, um, the coffee stuff. I'm going to go ahead and save that for later. Uh, I'm not big into the hot stuff, so I'm not worried about the hot sauce. But, uh, you know, if you guys want to get things like this, this is this is great. Obviously, there's those dehydrated meals. And, uh, you know, if you have the ability to take um, take with you something a little more substantial, something like this is better than maybe those dehydrated meals. Uh, obviously, if you're going to be gone for long periods of time to carry the amount of food like this that you would need, it would be rather heavy because you still have all the water in there that gives you all the weight. Uh, but if you're only going to be gone for a day or two or something like that, something like this would be great for one or two people. Um, you could have just a, a few packages of this and you know you would really be good for for each day and it would it would do you really well. But uh, yeah, if you guys want to check this out, go down there. Description below, obviously, link to the Amazon site. We also got the social media down there. Don't forget that. Of course, you want to check out our Facebook and Instagram and stuff like that. And uh, also, there is that link down there, the PayPal link. Uh, that is in place of a Patreon link. I went with PayPal instead of Patreon. If you guys want to uh, help out with the channel... All right, guys. Well, my name's Cougar. This is The World of Me, another episode from our Camping and Survival series, as well as the Amazon Review series. I'd like to wish you all a good day, and I will see you later. Bye!